Welcome back to Terramator Gardens. Today we're going to be diving into the world of dwarf purple isopods. The dwarf purple isopod is a species of terrestrial isopod found in tropical and subtropical regions. Native to the Caribbean, these small crustaceans have adapted to thrive in moist environments where they contribute significantly to the decomposition process. Their presence in various parts of the world today can be attributed to their popularity in the pet trade and their use in bioactive setups. Dwarf purple isopods are tiny, measuring around 3-5 to five millimeters in length. They are easily identified by their striking purple hue and soft, velvety exoskeleton. Their bodies are segmented, allowing them to curl up into a ball when threatened. Despite their small size, their vibrant color makes them stand out, making them a popular choice for hobbyists. These isopods have antennae that they use to navigate their environment and detect food sources. These isopods thrive in environments with high humidity and consistent moisture. They prefer temperatures between 68 degrees and 82 degrees Fahrenheit. In captivity, they are kept in terrariums or vivariums with a substrate that retains moisture, such as coconut coral or moss. It's essential to provide a habitat with plenty of hiding spots using leaf litter, bark, or other organic material to mimic their natural environment. Regular misting helps maintain the necessary humidity levels. They do not tolerate dry conditions well and require a damp environment to survive. Dwarf purple isopods are detritivores, meaning they feed on decaying organic matter. Their diet primarily consists of decomposing plant material, leaf litter, and decaying wood. In captivity, they can be supplemented with a variety of foods such as fish flakes, fruit, vegetables, and specialized isopod food. Providing a calcium source like cuddle bone helps with their exoskeleton development. One fascinating behavior of dwarf purple isopods is their tendency to curl into a ball when disturbed, a defense mechanism known as conglobation. This behavior protects their soft undersides from predators. They are also highly social creatures, often seen in groups as they forage for food and interact with the environment. Their nocturnal activity patterns mean they are most active during the night, making them an intriguing species to observe during evening hours. Dwarf purple isopods coexist well with other small invertebrates and can be included in bioactive terrariums. They make excellent cleanup crews for enclosures, housing reptiles and amphibians, helping to break down waste and organic debris. Their small size and non-invasive nature ensure they do not disturb other inhabitants. They also play a role in aerating the soil, which benefits plant roots and overall substrate health. In addition to their role as decomposers in nat natural and captive ecosystems, dwarf purple isopods are valued for their aesthetic appeal. The vibrant purple coloration adds a unique visual element to terrariums. Furthermore, they help maintain the health of substrate by aerating the soil and breaking down organic matter, thereby reducing the need for frequent cleaning. Their presence in a terrarium can enhance the ecological balance, promoting a healthier environment for all inhabitants. Dwarf purple isopods are remarkable for their ecological role, unique behaviors, and striking appearance. Incorporating them into your terrarium not only enhances the visual appeal, but also promotes a healthy, balanced ecosystem. Enjoy the fascinating world of these tiny yet impactful creatures. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Happy keeping.